Hey guys, Fantasy Sports Girl Lorraine here, and I've got my sleeping bag because we're going camping, fantasy style. That's right, with mini camps behind us. It's time to start focusing on the fantasy players who'll be making a mark on your roster this season. So let's take a trip down to the ATL. As always, we'll start with the quarterback. And for Falcon fans, it's rough, so I'll be gentle. Atlanta turned the page by selecting Matt Ryan in the draft, but it's unlikely he'll see early action. That leaves Chris Redman and Joey Harrington, and neither of them should be anywhere near a fantasy roster. Receiver Roddy White has a fantasy dream with 83 catches for 1,202 yards and six touchdowns. With numbers like that, owners will be tempted to draft him early. Don't be that guy. White and every other Atlanta receiver still need someone to get him the ball. Which brings us back to the quarterback issue. Don't expect tight end to be a productive position either. One time fantasy said Algie Crumpler has been cut leaving unproven Ben Hartsock to handle things. It's not all bad news for the offense though. The Falcons did sign Michael Turner. The Chargers super sub is expected to shoulder a heavy load in Mike Malarkey's run first offense. His track record projects him to be a solid number two fantasy back. But with their quarterback problems, teams will load eight in the box to stop him, so draft wisely. And then there's the defense. 30th in sacks, 29th in points, 29th in yards, and near the bottom in turnovers. New coach Mike Smith had a great D in Jacksonville, but making this unit fantasy worthy is nearly impossible. That's all I've got for now, so get back to work. And remember to check out more videos on FantasySportsGirl.com.